before TVGN, there was the guide. That was then. This is now. All programming, no guide. TV Guide Network is now TVGN. It's a new look. It's a new era. It's a new logo. The stars. The fashion. She's very classic. The glamour. We are live for the Academy Awards. It's a new look. It's a new logo. It's TVGN. This is Hollywood. Previously on Nail Files. I came from a small prison town. I moved to a big city, and I am going to make my dreams come true. We are producing a large scale event this year at Sundance and would love for you to come out and post our gifting suite. The Sundance Film Festival is a big deal. This is my opportunity to get press. Have you got the status on like any tickets, hotel, anything um, for Sundance? I thought. Becky is my assistant. Becky is supposed to be doing things that I can't do. How are my displays getting there? I have no idea. We're supposed to check in in half an hour. This is the only flight, and it's my whole brand on the line right now. The driver was like, What are you doing? What are you doing? And tonight, this is a big deal. This is my business. All of the utilities have been shut off in my store. Do you understand how much I trust you right now? Zero. <laughs> Sir, you're really putting us in danger. Can you get over? Amy and I are going to Sundance. We're driving to the airport, and we're swerving all over the freeway. And I want to get out of this car right now. You need to pull off the freeway. Look how this guy's driving. You need to get off right now. Get off the freeway. Get off. Hey, what is he I doing? Can't. What are you doing? <laughs> My whole life is like crashing in on me. Like everything fell to hell. I have to do something. Can you pull over? Sir, I'm, I'm the client. Pull over. I'm getting out and getting a cab. I'm not doing this. Finally, he pulls over, and another driver shows up to help. Oh my God. Okay, our driver's here. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. Is he okay? He's got this phone. We should call 911. Is he gonna be okay? Oh my God, I should help him. This is freaking me out because I feel like he's gonna die. Does he need like insulin or something? He needs sugar. I just asked Amy, oh my gosh, what's in your bag? And she had a granola bar. I just feel like you should like have sugar or something in your system. He eats it and I could tell that he felt better. Bye. I'm sorry that I yelled at you. I feel really bad, but I didn't know what was wrong. I felt like the worst human being in the world. I have completely like ripped this guy a new ass. Don't worry about our bags, it's okay. No. No, no, no. Luckily, he lived. I'm gonna call and see if we can rebook our flights. There's, I'm so nervous. We've missed our flight. We're not getting to Sundance. Like, no way. How are we gonna get a second flight? We're so screwed. No. Oh my God, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. We can't, we can't go tomorrow. We had to scramble to find two tickets the day before Sundance. I desperately have to be there today. Just get me on any plane to Park City. We will take it, we'll take it. Luckily, we are getting on the last plane to Park City, Utah. I was like, ah, <laughs> Okay, here you go. This is for you. Doesn't matter how cool your boss is, your boss is your boss. So when the boss is gone, you get that little feeling of like freedom. <laughs> as long as we're not hurting nobody, like, I don't see anything wrong with it. <laughs> Oh my god. Yes, we made it. Do you know what happened to us? Oh, 
Thank the oh. Lord. <laughs> I'm Katie's personal publicist. We set up appointments for her with different celebrities that are gonna come through, and that in itself is something that's really helpful and gets her face and brand and things like that out there. Thanks. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'll be in my room. Thanks. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. See you again. I have the last available room in all of Sundance. I pray to God this isn't a hellhole. Do we take this key? Get. <laughs> Shut up. Woo! Oh, my God. Pop it bottle. Be like, Shut the hell up. It's a f***ing hot tub. There is a steaming, fired up jacuzzi overlooking all of Park City. Oh, this is redonkulous. Hello, Park City! <laughs> I have to get your feet back. <laughs> Go! <laughs> <laughs> I have to pee! Okay, I have cute Anna? jackets for you guys. Awesome. One of the most important things about doing a gifting suite is knowing what celebrities are coming. Yeah, that's cute. The celebrities check out your product while the press takes pictures. This one has like a green or red. That's beautiful. According to Relina, there's gonna be like really big A-list celebrities coming through. I just feel like it's gonna be fabulous and glamorous. This is like all about my store and the motto and the funness of the whole thing. Cool. Well, thank you. Thank I you. Run, so I know, well, come in and visit me. Oh my gosh, guess who's here? A bunch of randoms. And I'm like, that's bull. Where is Relina? I just want to know who's coming in here. Um, okay, who do we have on the list? Now I'm totally flanked. Relina's not free. She's not volunteering to do this for like a Girl Scout badge. She's getting paid a lot of money. Terrence Howard is upstairs. Mm -hmm. Then we have like um, Toby McGuire, Emma Roberts. I want to be believing in Relina. I want to believe what she tells me. <laughs> I didn't see Jennifer Garner. And I didn't see Tobey Maguire. And I didn't see Oprah. I didn't see anybody. I don't want to look like some like melting down bitch, but what the f When you're told that all of these people are gonna come and they don't, it's kind of like a huge waste of time. I say we go. Okay. I think Relina definitely did not follow through with what she promised, Katie. I'm sorry, it's ridiculous, if you ask me. We didn't see anybody famous, and we're right on Maine. We have this beautiful view, so we're gonna get in the hot tub. So here's to Sundance 2011. Next year, I want to go to Cancun. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers to that. Cheers. I can't get out. It's too snowy, and I'm nervous. I, I just feel like I'm gonna freeze my balls off. Amy's like my partner in crime. If I was attracted to women, Amy would be my girlfriend. Oh, 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 oh. Go, 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 go. It's like walking on the road. Oh, 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 oh. I'm trying to, so that it doesn't say leave a message after your tone. I'm trying yeah. to do it where it's like, hey, painted nail, blah, blah, blah. Thank you for calling the painted nail. No, that was bad. Thank you for calling the painted <laughs> nail. This is Jennifer. What can I do you for? Thank you for calling the painted nail. Let's see if it worked. Hello. Um, Please leave a message after the tone. I can't set up an answer machine. What the frick? Oh my god! What? Okay, Haley Duff just tweeted about the painted nail today. Oh my God, I'm downloading it. What? Hold on, look at this. Come here, come here. Look it, Haley Duff. Oh my God. God. No, look at this. She just tweeted this. Look, at Hillary Duff and I named three polishes for our friend Katie at the painted nail. <laughs> a week ago, Hillary and Haley Duff came into the painted nail and I got them to name my polishes. It's been viewed almost 3,000 times. Having an A-list celebrity love your product can make or break your product line. We need to do a toast to this. I know. I can do my own PR without Relina. Thank you very much. Here's to Twitter. Coming up. How are you guys doing? Hello there, hello there, hello there. I need to go over and be two shorts, bitch. <laughs> What's going on? This has been like a crazy long day and it only gets worse. What? Are you quitting? They're Oscar winners. 
humanitarians, moguls. But who cares? Let's get to the close. She looked like an angel. It was a disaster. An epic fail. In Celebrity Style Story, watch the stars rise to fame through their fashion. J-Lo nailed it. Every show a new star. See how these stylistas went from fashion freshmen. She looked like she was an alien. It just was a hot mess. To great at Glamazons. It was ravishing. Yeah. yeah. Catch back-to-back -back episodes of Celebrity Style Story, Sundays at 1110 Central on TVGN. <laughs> I get home from Sundance. I'm so excited to see Walter. I never want to be away from him for that amount of time ever again. Look how huge my boobs look. Look at me. You're always fishing for a compliment. You have to fish with me. Sugar. I think you're the most beautiful woman in the world. I love you. Of course you look cute. Babes, why didn't you cut your eyebrows? What is this? There. I like that. Girls already do again. Oh my god. I'm kind of excited to see like how it went with me being gone and hopefully seeing that the painted nail didn't burn down to the ground. Kimmy, so you and Chalet are gonna be doing the services, only you and her, and it's gonna be on the first two chairs. Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello. How can I help you? Need uh, two manicures. Okay. okay. Manicure. Two okay. manicures. This is really cool to have two short in the painted nail. Guess who just walked in? Who? Guess. I'm Guess. gonna die. Too short. Shut the hell up. <laughs> too short and some beautiful blonde lady with him. I actually thought it was you at first. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> so what flavor do you want for your ice cream pedicure? You wanna smell like chocolate? <laughs> no? Minty fresh? <laughs> Hi. How are you guys doing? Hello there, hello there, hello there. Just let me know what you need. I'm like dying right now. The <laughs> Too Short is in the store. He's the same caliber as Dr. Dre, Snoop Dogg. I need to go over and be Too Short's bitch. No doubt about it. So your new talent? We haven't worked together yet. We're we haven't getting worked together, this is, but... This is how I do it. This is <laughs> yeah. how I do this it. This is how you do your work. Let's yeah. drink. Let's, yeah. let's make a song. This is my yeah, drink. Yeah, yeah. I'm ready to record an album. <laughs> You'd have a great song with Miss Katie. She knows how to bust it out. Oh my God, <laughs> stop yes, the do. madness. You're good. The girls are having a blast. So I decided to write Too Short a Rap. The owner is funny and she's really witty, but I really want her to whip out her <laughs> <laughs> Or yeah, funny. I can do like a really good like ass thing. I can like make my ass clap. <laughs> no, it's <laughs> weird. <laughs> Clap is where you shake your ass meat. Okay, ready? There's a song about that too. <laughs> yes, yeah, mama. Make it clap. We're gonna make a toast to the booty. <laughs> oh, thank you. To the booty. Put this baby in, bring the other one out. Oh my God, that's amazing. Okay, hold on one second. Oh my God, you guys, Walter's album just got nominated for a Grammy. Yeah! Walter wrote and produced Kenny G's album. I'm just so excited for Walter. Okay, I'll call you later, I love you. And by the way, I'm going to the Grammys. <laughs> For a party! <laughs> you missed the spot. What? Missed the spot. I'm not done yet. How about, wow, you look pretty today, or something like uh, that? I don't know, oh, try okay. that. <laughs> I've already told you that stuff, sweetie. You look beautiful. Bye, I'll call you later. I'm on my way to my publicist. I try calling the salon. Sorry, you have reached a number that has been disconnected or is no longer in service. What the? Hey, Becky, I just tried to call you on two different numbers. Okay, so the office line, that's what you need to go. Yeah, but why didn't it get paid? Because I was waiting for the approval. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pay that bill. Hold on, give me one moment. Hello? <sighs> 
I can't even leave the salon for two seconds. Heavy call volumes may result in a delay before being connected. Hello? I feel like the only thing Becky was assisting in was me having a nervous breakdown. All of our service representatives are currently assisting other customers. Having a boss like Katie, it's just so crazy that coming into work every day, you never know what to expect. There's just so much in her life that it's crazy. Our least busy time is Wednesday through Friday. Hello? Really? This is how mornings start for me. After Sundance, it just seemed like I need to have a meeting with Merlina and kind of feel it out because I'm not feeling it right now. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. Hi. Hi. Katie's Sundance gifting experience, I think, went really, really well. I think that Katie's favorite part of Sundance was meeting some cool industry people and talent and things like that. I literally was like, looking for like super awesome A-list people. But the thing with you have to understand that about these events, those people don't come to these events. Am I dreaming? Why didn't you tell me that before Sundance? You Sundance was like crazy expensive for me. Crazy. In all honesty, I have friends that are famous. I might as well just call them and be like, come to the store and hold my product. Right. Um, okay. Oh my God. I look down at my phone, and it's like the power went out in the painted nail. And then another text comes in. There's no water either. We just have to talk about it and figure it out. OK. I am mortified right now. I have to deal with this problem immediately. We'll have our meeting on Monday, and then I will call you. I feel like Job, except without like the boils and my camels were murdered or whatever the story was. Becky, I'm really to the point of so upset, like I'm shaking. Where's all my paperwork? Where's my, my bills? What has been paid? What hasn't? Like this is madness. My bill is $5,000 that I need to pay in full to get the lights and the water working. Do you understand how much I trust you right now? Zero. This is a big deal. This is my business, you know? I know. I'm really hard. Like, I'm so this is my, my weakness, is I become compassionate for people, and I feel bad for them. I'm really, really sorry. I swear I mean it. All right, well, I'm, I'm glad that I got to talk to you about this. I'll talk to you tomorrow. OK, bye. Bye. Ugh, oh, brutal. Hi. Oh my God, it's been so long. How was the traffic? Oh, it was not too bad. I needed to meet with Kelly, one of my really good friends. OK, so what were She you has been there, done that with publicists, managers, boyfriends, whatever. Today I called the store. It's like, the number you have called has been disconnected or whatever. She goes, oh, yeah, we forgot to pay the bill. I so go do you, like, instill the three strike rule? Um, no. You get three strikes. First is a mistake. Second is you're bad. Third is you're done. I feel like I can't just fire people. You know, like I'm some heartless bitch. I'm not that way. It's a business. It's not personal. Hi. Can we meet tonight? Who is that? Becky. She's like, the store is fine, but I just need to talk to you tonight. Oh, gosh. I'm just going to call her really quick. Do it. Hey, what's going on? This has been like a crazy long day, and it only gets worse. What? Are you quitting? Coming up, she just quit. Becky quit? With no notice or anything. How much more responsibility do I have to take on right now? I'm just thinking about how overwhelmed I'm going to be. Hey, what's going on? Can you just tell me what it's kind of about? All of the utilities have been shut off in my store, and all of a sudden, my assistant calls me. What? Are you quitting? I don't know if I'm the person for this job. I just don't think I'm doing it to stability. It makes you happy, and... You think? So you're not, no notice, nothing. You're just not going to come to work tomorrow? That's the thing. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Becky says, I can't come to work tomorrow or ever. 
Okay, good to know. Okay, thank you, Bye. <sighs> um, are you kidding me right now? <laughs> Bring on the chocolate cake. cake. So Where's it at? <laughs> chocolate where's, cake. Where's the cake? How much more can a human being take in one day? Hey, I talked to Becky earlier. She just quit. Becky quit? With no notice or anything. <laughs> I feel like I'm so busy and I'm so overwhelmed. Can you explain to me dozens of times when that Becky has just screwed up? I'm just thinking about how overwhelmed I'm going to be. <laughs> How much more responsibility do I have to take on right now? Well, I'm gonna help until you find a replacement. The good thing is, is I am gonna save $2,300 a month. So it's kind of like... <laughs> Walter's always saving the day for me with his words. It may be why he's so good at writing beautiful songs. It's because he is like a passionate, sensitive guy and he gets me. Okay, well, I'm gonna come home right now. and I just don't even wanna be upset about it anymore. All right, I love you. Stupid Becky. Next time on Nail Files, Walter wrote and produced Kenny G's album and it's nominated for a Grammy. Do I get to buy a new pair of Louboutins to go with my Grammy dress, I'm gonna please? Go later. Walter, Bye. this year, we are going to the Grammys. So I need to make a statement. Skimpy, yeah. low, naughty, yeah. but in a good way. About 12,000. God. I need to go back to the house, put my dress on. What am I missing? I forgot my nails. What the Kiss your mother with that mouth? Yes, I do, and she likes it. Shoes. <laughs>